Hey guys, it's our 11th week and this is our Rest On Us devotion. So this song is a really spiritually led song. It makes you feel and know that God and the Holy Spirit is in the room with you. So a verse to kind of go along with this song is Romans 5.5. 5. And hope does not put us to shame because God's love has been poured out into our hearts through the Holy Spirit who has been given to us. So like the verse says, the Holy Spirit has been given to us. So if it's given to us as a gift, then why should we not use it? Um, if the Holy Spirit's, if, if we have it as a gift, it's like if you get a gift for your birthday, and why would you not use that gift if someone's given it to you? Well, God's given us the Holy Spirit to use as a guide. So why should we not use it if God gave it to us? God gives us a gift. That's the best gift you've ever gotten in your life. So you should definitely use it. Um... So, but the Holy Spirit is also um, our helper. But we as Christians, when we worship, should help the Holy Spirit also move in the room. So if us as a band just stood there and didn't move and didn't show any kind of emotion or really showed that we were worshiping when we sang, um, it wouldn't help the Spirit move. But since we are up there truly worshiping our God and feeling Him move in the room, then it helps Him move more through you all with our singing, playing the guitar, and the cajon. But, so yes, the Holy Spirit is with us, but we also need to invite him to move in our everyday lives because he won't move unless we invite him in. So yes, he is given to us as a gift, but if we don't use that gift, then he it's not he's not going to do anything. So we've got to actually use our gift of the Holy Spirit and of him with us so we can use him in our everyday lives and help him move. Because... He helps us, but we also have to help him too. So um, I just pray that uh, you all will take a moment today and invite him in the room and let him rest on you. So I hope you all have a good week. Hey guys, I just wanted to start the prayer. So bow your heads with me. Lord, we, we just thank you that you know, you, you've given us your Holy Spirit. Lord, help it to just come and rest on us. Lord, help us to just go throughout life, you know, guiding Letting your Holy Spirit guide us, Lord. Um, letting it bring us closer to you and just getting better with the way we are, Lord. Help it to convict us and to show us the right way, Lord. We want to thank you for it. And Lord, we want to thank you that, you know, through worship and just being with friends and, and whatever it may be, Lord, in the word, that your spirit just rests upon us, Lord, and we can really be connected to you. Uh, in that way, Lord. And we just want to thank you for worship, for prayer, for the word, um, for fellowship, for other believers, Lord, for people that you've placed in our uh, lives to confide in and talk to and really grow with. Um, and I know that your spirit's all around us in that. Um, and we just want to thank you. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Hey guys, thanks for watching our video. We hope you all like our new logo. Oh, we hope you all have a great week. Thanks. God bless.